Hi guys, how are you today? Today I just want to share something with you. Prosperity. Prosperity is our birthright. It says here in the book I am reading that we have to practice prosperous mindset. So guys, I want to talk about this because I I'm working with myself about this. This is my own training and I am working in order to believe it and I have to work myself and I have to practice it from my own thoughts because everything start, starts from our mind and thoughts. Guys, I am only sharing with you some food for our mind and soul in order to keep on going because life is hard but we can do this journey together by sharing each other inspirational and motivational words to keep on going in this journey. And it is a work. It is a job to be done to ourselves. Yes, life is amazing, but you have to make it amazing. You have to pay the price. What is the price? You are going to work with yourself. So guys, it says here, Prosperity is our birthright. And the key of that, we have that in our thoughts to live an abundance life, to live a good life, to live a prosperous life by having that positive mental attitude. I am sharing this with you because many of us don't even think about it. Of course, during the new year, we greet each other, have a prosperous new year. But you think throughout the year, do you have a prosperous year? Every year, every new year, we greet each other, have a prosperous new year, happy new year, have a prosperous new year. We greet each other. But are you aware what you are talking? Are you aware how you deliver the word? Have you mean it? So guys, it says here, we all deserve to have a prosperous life. We all deserve it and we must believe it that we deserve it. If you believe in God, if you, will, if you don't believe in God, you, you believe in universe, whatever you are believing, you have to ask for it. Because it says here in this book, ask and it shall be given unto you. You want to live a prosperous life, then we have to ask for it, work with ourselves through our mindset and through our feelings. You have to put your effort into your feelings that you have a wonderful, prosperous life. You have to create it from your thoughts. You must be awake, focused, that you are a prosperous person. You live in a prosperous life. You live an abundant life. So guys, it says here, you have to ask for it. Believe that God can give that to you. Believe that the universe will deliver it to you, a prosperous, abundant life. It's not easy because of our negativity around us, the noise around us. But guys, when you are working with yourself, this is about self-development. When you are working with yourself, have time to have a moment for yourself. Contemplate, meditate. I always mention this, guys, that there is power in meditation and prayer. We believe in God, then we pray for it. Pray by asking it. You ask for it through your prayers that I want to have a prosperous life. I want to have an abundant life. Because it says here, everyone deserves to have a prosperous, abundant life. Everyone of us. But many of us, taking it for granted, we just overlook it. Because we read that from the book. We hear that, but we are not applying it with ourselves because it's just it is we are not aware of that but since i am working with myself guys i've been through a lot 
fibromyalgia, depression, anxiety. At the end of the day, you are the only one who can help yourself. But you must have that silence to listen yourself. Because God or the universe will deliver it to you what you are asking for if you are focused with yourself. You have the moment to listen what the universe, what God is telling you. You can feel that through your feelings, the frequency, the feelings, that, that excitement. I am prosperous. I am abundant. Just acknowledging it to yourself. And it says, hey guys, again, you have to say it aloud, loud and clear. You have to say that to yourself, that I am prosperous. I live an abundant life. I live a prosperous life. You have to say it to yourself. To believe it, you have to say it loud to yourself. Prosperity is my birthright. That is your birthright. Each and every one of us born in this earth with this quality, with this asset being a prosperous person because God created us equally. So, there's the work. You have to pay the price by doing it again and again. Say it aloud to yourself. Focus your feelings. You must, you must put your feelings into it and thoughts into it. That I have a prosperous life. See, it's not easy because we are not aware about it. We overlook it. We just read it from the book and it's just, it is. So guys, if you are with me in this journey, as you listen to me talking about this, I hope you will do it because I am doing it. This is the third time, guys, I'm reading this book. And it's time to put it into action. But first, I have to speak it, believe it, feel the feelings that I live a prosperous life. There are so many things to be grateful for because I am an abundant person. You must believe that though you are an abundant person. Because when you believe that, the prosperity thoughts will come also. That prosperity is your birthright. So guys, it is our work, but it is for the good of ourselves. It is for the good of our business. It is for the good of the people who live with us. Because you feel great. You feel great by having that prosperous mentality. That you are prosperous. Guys, nobody can do that to yourself except you. When you want to change anything in your life change your feelings change the frequency of your thoughts and feelings and put it into action of course it sounds crazy especially if the, you leave the people who are not the same mindset with you it's difficult but you have to explain them you have to tell them that this is what it is i want to practice a prosperous life because prosperity is my birthright i have to apply it to myself by thinking it by feeling it and the secret is the feeling of happiness every day although despite of the consequences hindrances throughout the day you must feel that feeling of happiness spend that time to yourself to have that feeling of happiness because when you are happy within you some other things will follow and it even says here guys the blessings will just easily come to you the wonderful thoughts then the ideas of having a good business the ideas of creating something it will come easily to you if you have this prosperous mindset happiness within you because through your feelings god will talk to you the universe will deliver it to you what you are asking for are you ready to ask for it guys it is 
in our life already because it is written here. Prosperity is our birthright. But we have to claim it now. We have to claim it that it is our birthright by practicing it with ourselves, practicing it that I am prosperous. I can do all things. I have to claim it and you have to feel it through your feelings because the universe and God will give us the way to reach that goal we want in our life. A goal of harmonious life, a goal of happiness, but happiness can be created only by you. You are the one who will feel the feeling of being happy, being prosperous, being grateful that you have this birthright so guys this is my share with you today i'm just so excited you must feel excited guys when you have this prosperous mindset i feel excited because i am working with myself prosperity is my birthright you can say that again and again many times throughout the day because the more you say it the more you believe it the more you will feel it inside guys i am not a master i am still a student processing all these things learning practice reading and putting it into action through my feeling and through my thoughts so i can share it with you i am in the process of learning and i hope guys that you will do the same because this life is amazing but we have to do the work the effort of practicing it again and again Practice makes a man perfect. So practice it again and again, saying it to yourself. Prosperity is my birthright. We deserve it. We claim it. And we must declare it that I have that birthright. So claim it by asking. We must ask from God. We must ask from the universe. It will be delivered to you in its perfect divine timing there is divine timing guys in everything believe have faith in it and put your feelings into it then you will receive it in its perfect divine timing guys thank you so much guys for listening this is yundel again speaking and i love you all thank you so much for following me bye